dive into a journey of self-discovery and empowerment with our game-changing guide, Nine Ways to Become Mentally Stronger and Fearless in Life This Year. If you're seeking resilience, courage, and a mindset shift, you're in the right place. Get ready to unlock your untapped potential and redefine what's possible for you. First on our list is Master Your Emotions. Your dominant thought often dictates the end result, meaning if you think you're going to fail, you have already convinced yourself you will. Avoid this mindset and replace this thought with, I will do this. It's the power of positive thinking that will give you the best chance to succeed in your life. Don't worry, reframing your mind with this technique takes time, but through repetition, you will change your outlook from negative to positive. Our emotions play a big role in how we act or react to negative situations. It's therefore important internally to understand and acknowledge your feelings and how they affect our decisions. Why is it important to internalize thoughts? Emotional awareness helps you avoid making irrational choices driven by emotions. Second is set new goals. New goals allow for new accomplishments. People have different ways of coping with negative emotions such as anger, outbursts, anxiety, or sadness. But these common coping methods will only make them feel better for a short time, often with long-term regrets. Start with evaluating your skills and develop a long-term strategy that helps you avoid or regulate these feelings without damaging your health or relationships. How? Diverting your mind from the issue at hand through physical movement, including exercising, Dancing, a walk in nature, drawing, or any other interesting activity may work best. How can exercise help you to become mentally stronger? Regular exercise each week has been proven to reduce stress, boost your self-esteem, improve sleep patterns, ward off anxiety and feelings of depression. Weekly exercise produces endorphins that interact with the receptors in our brain that reduce the perception and feeling of pain. In short, Neurotransmitters like dopamine and serotonin trigger a positive feeling and reaction in the body that creates a powerful change in our mindset. Train moderately for a month and you will see the evidence. Third is making and reviewing a list means accountability. Try more action and less theory. Time to get the wheels moving. For most of us, old habits do not die hard, however. If your intent to change is strong, you will make it happen. Reading blogs like this on nine ways to become mentally stronger and fearless is great for guidance and tips. However, until you take responsibility and action, nothing will help you move forward. A good starting point to becoming mentally stronger is write down your short-term goals. Why? It makes it real and you are accountable. No longer is it a false promise to yourself. Being committed to your goal will not only improve your mental strength over time, it will also help you develop new relationships, drop old habits, develop better methods of doing things. Fourth is focus on making yourself happy first. You feel mentally stronger if you are happy. It's time to take back the power of your happiness. Avoid making compromises to please others at the expense of following your dream. The fear of disappointing others may hold you back, so you need to focus on your own personal goals and develop the courage to make decisions that work for you without fearing upsetting some people. Fifth is, no risk equals no reward. You can only develop yourself if you have the courage to take risk. Whether your challenge is about leaving your current job to start your own business or breaking unhealthy relationships, it's all about taking risks to move to the next level in your life and seizing the opportunity. Breaking new ground and achieving new goals means taking risks you once thought was impossible. The word itself gives you the best clue. I'm possible. Sixth on our list is we all make mistakes. Making a mistake is not failure. Failing to learn from that mistake is failure. How can any of us grow without failure? Failing and succeeding is all a part of life. It is possible to shy away from trying something because of your past mistake, but trying and failing is healthy for your growth. Do not fear making a mistake. Instead, learn something new from your experiences and use the knowledge to make better decisions in the current situation. Seventh is small wins make for big gains. Simple wins in life makes us feel good. Through feeling better, we become mentally stronger. For example, if you decided one morning to start running, don't start with five miles per day. 
Instead, start with five miles per week and give yourself a target you know you can achieve. Set yourself small targets that you can tick off. The goal is to set yourself up for success, not failure. Eighth point is forget about your past. Energy is powerful, so focus your outlook on what makes you productive. Dwelling on your past failure or success may deter you from achieving your goals. Whether you have had a good or bad past, you need to put it behind and focus your time and energy on your new target. And last on our list is celebrate or contemplate. We can choose to celebrate our success or contemplate why we are failing. Perhaps a healthy balance is key. Frustration and negative thoughts can get the best of us at times. However, a common factor in fearless people is they change from contemplating defeat to celebrating their wins. Why is celebrating wins important? Too much negative thinking can sap our energy and weaken our state of mind. By reminding ourselves of the great work we have done in the past, we allow ourselves to move forward with confidence. A negative person attempts 10 new things. He or she fails at one. They will always focus on why that one was a failure. A positive person will try 10 new things, again fail in one. However, they will celebrate their nine new successes. Reframing your mind takes time, but being aware of negative thinking allows you now to consider an alternative thought pattern and create more positive habits in your daily life. You can make yourself feel worse or better. Try the latter more often. In closing, becoming mentally strong doesn't happen overnight. It's the result of good habits practiced daily. Strong-minded people simply set boundaries, have respect for themselves, and don't expect others to take the reins in their life. If you like this, then don't forget to subscribe.